like and subscribe. Thank you. So we love to read a book. You know that. I know that. But someone here <laughs> perpetually needs to challenge that. Oh, oh, hey, storyteller thing. Hello, Witchificent. Whatever brings you by. As if we didn't know. Well, I couldn't help but notice that you have a big problem. Do I? It says definitely do not open this book. So you can't read this book no matter what your shirt says. <laughs> so I guess this is goodbye, everyone. Nothing to see here. Goodbye. Ah, but the Storyteller Creed says Storyteller Creed that I have to read a book that lands on my desk no matter what, even if the book says that I can definitely do not open it. Oh, but <laughs> that would that would make you naughty, a rule breaker, and everyone knows that you're a goody two shoes. And you know what? I am a goody two shoes, and some rules are made to be broken. <laughs> so you're saying that you are definitely going to open this book? Definitely. Even though it says definitely do not open this book. I'm going in. <laughs> I win. What are you talking about? <laughs> I've made you naughty and bad. <laughs> I'm not bad or naughty. But sometimes, kid, when you want to be good, you have to be a rebel. I just got here, but I like where this is going. I just got here, and I am very nervous. Are you ready to be a rebel and read a book? Yeah, you are. Here we go. Oh, oh. Okay, I wasn't scared until now. Hmm. Are we seriously going to do this again? Who is this bureaucrat who already looks very upset? and not wanting to work, even though he's only serving number two for the day. Wiz, apparently, the chairman of the Department of Obvious Affairs. Uh, I'm sure we can convince Wiz that we're here for a good reason. I'm actually closed for the day, so please come back. Never closed forever. No, that can't be right. An important office like the Department of Obvious Affairs can't be closed forever. You know what? Let's just keep being rebels. Good grief, you stuck around. Well, I can tell you there's no point in turning any more pages because I know for a fact that this book's not even finished. There's only blank pages from here on in. See? Actually, I, I really can't see. There's nothing! See? Nothing to see here at all. All that rebellion was for nothing. Bye-bye! Bye-bye! Uh, uh, it was bad seeing you all. Bye! Everyone, go away now! I'm suspicious. Let's keep going. Oh, gosh. That is... An intense yawn. Okay, as it turns out, there was something on this page. My bad. Mm-hmm. But I just tunneled through to the next page to confirm that there is absolutely and categorically nothing there. This book finishes right here, so please don't turn the page. Oh, sorry, Teller. The blue thing called Wiz said please, so I think that maybe you should listen to him. Doug the Dinosaur. I'm going to tell you something. Oh, no. You're going to turn the page aren't you? Doug, I just don't think that this blue guy named Wiz is actually telling us the truth. <gasps> you mean he's lying to us? I suspect so, yes. So that's why I feel like we should not listen to him. Well, if you think he's lying to us, how could you? Okay, okay, I understand and I will support you, but I'm going to go over there, okay? Okay, let's go. <gasps> okay, you got me. I lied. There was something happening on this page as well. Oh, how could you? You were right. Oh, and because of my lie, you nearly didn't get to see this adorable puppy. Oh, puppy, puppy. A puppy that only exists on this page and needs 
is your love, so never leave it. Oh, I cannot leave this beautiful puppy with the big eyes. Dog, you think he's lying to us again? I think this puppy is a decoy. <gasps> okay. For little Nellie's sake, please don't turn the page. Bye, Nellie. Mm. Bye. Bye. Bye, Nellie. Oh, my! <laughs> Gosh, these yawns are so contagious. You went and turned the page again. <gasps> I'll level with you. Really? Now you're gonna level with us? A pixie put a spell on me that makes me more and more tired with every page you turn. Seriously, a pixie? Pixies are so cute and adorable and, oh. Well, that pixie looks, hmm, like she's definitely up to something. What, what is she doing? Get, get back there, get back on your page. Get back to the right spot. Rebel Pixie. Let's see, there's a chart here, the tiredness level that is commensurate with the page turning. So if we turn one page, it'll be yawning, and then there will be drowsiness, and then there will be nodding off, and then there will be ice cream dreams. Uh, uh, I don't mind stopping at ice cream dreams. No, we can't stop, won't stop, Green Bear. <laughs> And then after ice cream dreams, they're sleepwalking and then pillow hugging and then sound asleep. I love sleeping and dreaming of ice cream, but I don't want to sleep yet. So please don't turn the page. My goodness, what have you done? I need to wake up. A strong pinch will do. Ow! Ow! That looks painful. Yes, the pinch worked. I'm awake now, and I want to stay this way. So I'm pleading with you. Please don't turn the page. That blue thing is clearly in distress. You wouldn't, would you? I would. Ooh, you're so terrible. <sighs> How could you? She's the worst after what I just said. Oh gosh, I'm exhausted. Let me just prepare an ice bath. I'll need it to wake up. It won't take long. Promise me you won't turn the page. I promise nothing of the kind. <sighs> <laughs> Maybe vanilla is the best ice cream flavor. Oh, we're at the ice cream dreams part. Splash! What? You turned the page again, didn't you? Jeepers, this is cold. But it's done the trick. It's woken me up. So please don't turn the page again. Do it, do it, turn it, turn it, turn it, turn it. Ha ha, I've outsmarted you this time. I know you turned the page again, so I quickly turned on all the lights to keep me awake. Gee, it's <clears throat> bright, isn't it? It must be hurting your eyes, so you'd better just put the book down and never turn a page again. I'm fine. You're out of control, and I think I like it. I am nervous and excited at the same time. Gosh, I'm really drowsy now. This will stop you, though. I've installed a fingerprint scanner that only one in a million people can get through. <laughs> Go on, try it. Then see if you can turn the page. All right, let's try it. Access granted. What are the chances your fingerprint worked? Please, please. I'm running on nothing now. I don't want to sleep. I don't want to miss out on anything. Wow, this wicked little sleep pixie really did a number on this blue guy. Please don't turn the page. 
Right! Toothpicks in the eyes, fans in the face, unlimited coffee, and an eight-piece brass band playing as loud as they can! Wow, it's loud! And oh, oh, I like this! The Coffee Max 7000 with fresh ground beans going all day, all night. Yes, sign me up for three more of those. All this will keep me up, but if you turn the page, I am done for. Please don't turn the page. Storyteller? Yes, Doug the Dinosaur, do you want me to not turn the page again? Actually, I want you to turn the page. <gasps> what? What? Why the change of heart? Well, I do not think that this blue guy named Wiz has been being very honest with us. You don't. No, he keeps lying about pages being blank and things not being there and then they are and he tricked me with that cute puppy dog and I think that he's just wanting to keep the book all to himself. So I think that because he has lied to us before, uh huh, he is lying to us again. Uh huh. So you should definitely turn the page because you are storyteller. I am storyteller and you read a book and we read a book. So we're doing this. We're doing this. Oh, I feel like such a rebel. Okay. This is it. I know how this ends in your pajamas, but there is something you hadn't considered. Oh? You too will probably have to go to sleep if you make it to the end of this book. What? You don't want that, do you? No. Come on, let's stay up together forever. Please, don't turn the page again. Storyteller. Yes? Don't fall for it. I will not fall for it. I will be strong, Doug the Dinosaur. Okay, okay. And I will be strong for you, too. Let's go. Okay, you know what? Is he even sleeping for real? I mean, he's standing up, and I have never in my entire life heard of an evil sleep-causing pixie. Storyteller, <laughs> storyteller, you accidentally fell asleep. <laughs> <laughs> What's happened? Is everybody, oh. <laughs> This is Doug the Dinosaur. I, I I am not gonna go onto the page because I do not want to accidentally fall asleep. <laughs> but uh, 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 be careful and uh, maybe you should not open the book if you don't want to fall asleep. Okay, okay, bye. <laughs>